Here are the top FMT news bites Wednesday, January 17th. A policeman was charged at the Ampang Sessions Court with raping a 17-year-old student. 31-year-old Fazlur Razi Yunus was also charged with carnal intercourse against the order of nature without consent, using an object during a sexual assault and sexually assaulting a minor. The offences were allegedly committed in a police patrol car near Jalan Presiaran Saujana Ampang at 10.30pm on January 9th. Water tariff rates for domestic users in Penang will double from February 1st onwards. Accounts that use 0 to 20 cubic meters a month will be charged 50 cent per cubic meter, compared with 22 cent now. Those who use 20 to 35 cubic meters a month will be charged 1 ringgit 10 cent per cubic meter, while those who use more than 35 cubic meters will need to pay 2 ringgit per cubic meter. Former Prime Minister Dr. Mahathir Mohamad is willing to meet National Unity Minister Aaron Agudagang on his recent controversial remarks about non-Malays. Previously, Aaron stated his willingness to meet with Mahathir if he persisted with his sensitive and divisive views. In a recent interview with Tamil news channel Tanti TV, Mahathir claimed that Chinese and Indians were different from the original people who founded the country as they did not speak Bahasa Melayu and had their own schools and culture. The director and producer of local indie film Muntega Terbang, which was banned by the authorities, have been charged in the Kuala Lumpur Magistrates Court. Kairi Anwar Jailani and Tan Meng Keng were charged with intentionally wounding the religious feelings of others. Two Malaysian terror suspects pleaded guilty yesterday to their involvement in the 2002 bomb attacks in Bali after spending 20 years in solitary confinement without trial in Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. By pleading guilty, Nazir Lep and Farik Amin have agreed to testify against Indonesian Enchip Nurjaman, more commonly known as Hambali, the mastermind behind the attacks. That's all for now. For more updates, log on to FMT and follow us here.